I'm just a poor wayfaring stranger. Welcome to Durham. The Oriental Museum is part of Durham University and it has an awesome collection including mummies. Like the fossil tree at Stanip, there is another fossil tree stump within the Botanic Gardens as well. Durham also boasts the creepiest place in Britain, or at least the creepiest playground. Almost a hundred gravestones line the walls of the park, while one remains in place. All to make way for play equipment that's been placed upon top of the bodies. Durham Prison, built in 1810. The last person to be hanged here was Private Brian Chandler for the murder of Martha Dodd in 1958. The castle was built in the 11th century and was home to the Bishop of Durham until 1840, when it became part of the university and still remains in part student dorms. Behind me is University Library on Palace Green, which hosts the Archaeology Museum. It has a nice small collection of artefacts. That's the Bishop of Durham's sword. Unfortunately, you can't see the Roman altar that we saw at Eastgate. So that was a bit of a disappointment. The original Roman altar set up at Eastgate in the 3rd century AD is now the property of Durham University. Ah, oh, this is a replica. Oh, hey, that's no good. The current cathedral was started in 1093 and completed in 1133. It was built to house the tomb of St. Cuthbert. 